Hey you guys. So I went on a date a couple of days ago and the guy said two things that really got me thinking. So before my journey, I typically dated guys that was that was like me, not necessarily overweight or obese or anything, but they were they didn't really they wasn't health conscious, you know, they wasn't, you know, worried about balanced meals or whatever. They ate like I ate fast food, whatever. And why I dated like that? Well, because it was comfortable. You know, I didn't have to worry about the guy worried about my weight, talking about my weight, you know what I'm saying? Just down talking me because we were pretty much on the same in the same mind frame. We like food, we ate food, we enjoy food together, you know? So at this point in my journey, you guys, the type of guys that I'm attracted to physically hasn't necessarily really changed. But I do always look towards my future. And so the type of guys that I'm attracted to now has changed in the sense that I typically go for guys that that care about their health. So I met this this particular young man out and about. We text a little bit, things like that, for a couple of weeks, and then we uh, went out on a, on a date. Well, when we were on the date, typically that's when I talk. Um, you know, you go through the about section, and um, I was telling him about my journey and things like that. And he started asking quest. He started asking questions about my journey. And so he he asked me, do I do I think I still have a problem with food? And I was basically like, well, yeah, I I think I have a problem with food. That's why I really don't I really don't buy snack foods and bulk and bring it into my house. I don't you know over I try not to overeat I don't really eat fast food and you know I was just kind of telling him a little bit about my journey things I don't do anymore and things like that so he stated to me that he enjoy fast food and he eats junk food and he buys it all and he buy it and he bring it into his house and if me and him was dating I can't really expect for him to change his eating habits because my problem with food is not his problem. I think he absolutely has a great point. My issue with food is absolutely my issue with food. I've been in a relationship on my journey and I know how um, it can be very detrimental to a journey if you get in a relationship with someone that doesn't really care about your health. So that is a route that I'm not willing to take anymore. I would prefer to be with someone that cares about their health, that cares about the different foods that they put into their mouth on a daily basis. And pretty much, I didn't really contact, you know, a couple of days after the date. And um, he hit me up and he was like, so why haven't I heard from you? And I explained to him basically what I just <laughs> said to you guys. And he said to me, well, I hope you stay happy and single. And I was so tickled, you guys. I, I probably laughed because, you know, it is what it is. So on top of that, he went on to say to me that, like, women require so much of men. They've always required so much of men. Now women also require men to care about their health and eat vegetables and all that. He was like, so you're going to forever be single because you'll never find a black man with everything you require plus care about fitness and hit the gym all the time. And I completely disagree with him. Um, and I think that that is a stereotype that is just crazy because as you guys know, I hit the gym almost every day or five days a week. And I see a lot of people of all different races in the gym every single day. So for people to think that a certain group of people don't care about their um, health is crazy. It's bonkers to me. And that just needs to just be washed away because it's not true. I remember a little while ago, um, a couple of years ago, it was a big debate on YouTube about weight loss journeys and being married and making your family, your husband, eat um, eat healthy. And, um, you know, it was like a going back and forth where some people were saying that you can't make someone eat how you eat or how you want them to eat, especially not a man. And, um, you know, the other side was saying just cook a certain way. Um, and and I, I don't know if y'all hear that, but it's like storming. <laughs> but anyway, um, 
And the other was, other side was saying just cook a certain way. You can, you know, kind of force your family to eat how um, eat healthier. But my thing about that is being a wife. Um, like is is that fair? Like so, say for example, y'all were y'all were married and you've always been overweight, and now all of a sudden you want to um, lose weight and eat healthy. Is that fair to force your husband to eat how you eat? And what if you cook healthier and he doesn't want it? He refused to eat it. As a wife, is that fair to only cook what's healthy and that will make you healthy and happier and lose weight without even considering what would make him happy? Um, it is a give and take, of course, but I would love, love, love to know how you guys feel about this topic and um, have you guys experienced this before? How you handled it? I would just love to know. So let me know below, you guys, and I thank you guys so very much for coming back for another dating topic and don't forget to thumbs up before you skedaddle and i will see you guys soon i love you bye